Hello Leo and welcome to your mid-January to the beginning of February reading for this current yar. yar. Leo and cross watchers is for Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Please check your charts. This guy's resonate with you or won't. You just boop your nose and away it goes. There's no point in worrying about shit if it ain't about you and it's none of your business. You right, you right. Okay. Leo, I'm doing a new layout, right? I'm pre- putting out cards because it tells the story a little bit more better than what I thought it would. Like I tried it last night and I liked it. It was just like, oh, this is like a little bit easier for me to pick up what I'm reading right here. I don't even know why I did it. It just happened. But yeah, definitely like good deal. Good eats. Like I'd show good eats. Right? So Leo, Yours is kind of interesting, you know? I'm looking over it, I've been looking over it, and it's just like, eh. It's like, two people want to break up, but neither one of them are breaking up. You know, uh, we got the Seven of Wands here where someone is on the defensive. Could be you, or it could be an Earth sign, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, um, who is being stagnant and refusing to offer something. And the situation is something's happening quickly, and it's a wish with a lot of fucking hubris. A lot of, uh, uh, I wish this would happen, or I wish this would happen. I think someone's wishing to break up? But they're not actually, like, what was it the last time I named your title? You, someone was, who's gonna bring the hammer down? I don't feel like anybody is. For now. Wants and wishes, two of cups. They need to possibly page cups, like someone wants and wishes to be- It's almost like there's a separation that's definitely wanted, but it's like it's not. Let's see. The obstacle and challenge, moving forward because it's too much of a burden. Someone can't do that. We got cancer right there, so you could be dealing with a water sign too. Uh, also an Aries. Anybody else? No, we got the Ace of Pentacles, well, possibly the Emperor, so it could also be a Taurus or a Libra as well, since she's here. Nine of Pentacles. Fears or Rejections is the Ace of Cups. is coming quick. And the how this shit starts out will end, well, it, it doesn't look like it's going to end, because nobody wants to break up with anybody. <laughs> so it's just like, I don't know. It feels like paranoia. What is here? Coincidence. A lot of people don't believe in coincidences. Or people think that there's no such thing as coincidences. I don't know. That word exists in the dictionary, so it must exist in other places. Anyway, let's lay these down. Seven of Wands. Or someone's trying to be on the defensive. Because they don't want to deliver something or give away something of value. I need to put some ashes on these cards because they're starting to stick. Or you're just not in that energy you want to talk. Huh? Baby powder. Baby powder? Oh, that would work. I need to find baby. That would make it smell a lot. Not gold bond in there. Okay, maybe I'll try that. Let's see. What's up with this? Ugh. They don't want to deliver it because it, like, it'd be sad and they'd be lingering over a heartbreak or whatever. Like, it would bother them too much because it would be, I guess... I don't make no fucking sense. Okay, whatever. Uh, well, are they upset because it's still there, or are they gonna just eventually get over it because it goes cold? No, I think they just rather make peace. It's just kind of like, nah, it's cool. Like, I wouldn't be. It's almost like they, it's like someone isn't able to deal with it because it'd be too much or something. But it's calling for patience and communication here with the Temperance card. Could be with the Sagittarius, right? And then we have Eight of Wands with the Nine of Cups reverse. So if someone's getting their wish really quick, it's not the way they think, I think. Could be an Empress right here, and she's the counterpart to the Emperor. So whoever this is, that's his wife, and she's quite angry, or nettled, or whatever. I don't know, she's just bothered. Could be a mother figure, your mom, your aunt, your cousin, your sister, that bitch down the street, whoever. She's just a really upset person. She could also... Be someone who fits a mom position too. Oh, 
She's a young empress. What? Hmm. Okay, so she's here twice. Like, the situation is like, something's moving fast, it has something to do with the wish, but it's still leaving this Empress feeling like, you know, she's not empowered somehow, or she doesn't have stability. Or she doesn't like the idea of being single, because that's all I'm getting for years, for you and Crosswatch. Let's see. I want to lie another one, because that one's, this is weird. They chose the black Betty, not the red Betty. Three of cups, yes. <laughs> but um, yeah, it's like like this is always like past Betty. This is new Betty, so you're like chose past Betty, but it's like yeah. I gotta finish this clean. Okay. Hmm. You're fine, babe. Alright, wants and wishes. Two of cups with the page of cups reverse. Separation, but it doesn't make anybody happy, I feel like. Yeah. Someone does want to stand in their truth with the king of swords, and both he and the upper are upright, so thank goodness someone is not being a douchebag. That's a good thing. This person's trying to do the right thing and say something, because he's got his sword down. Um, probably they don't idolize somebody as much as they used to. Let's see. But they don't know what to do. So they're just fucking confused as shit. I don't know. But we'll find out here when I clarify. Let's see. The chariot reverse with the ten of wands. They can't move forward because it's way too hard. It's like, it's a kind of a burden where it's like, I don't know if they'd be able to deal with it or not. Um, however, they will go to sleep and just let everything fucking burn. <laughs> Just be like, oh, I didn't know. Like, but it's like, huh? It's like they don't know, but they know. Like, I don't know. Like, usually King of Cups is like kind of a dick, but it's like his emotions are exposed. But it's like he's almost confused. I don't know. It's like he doesn't know what he's feeling until like later or some shit. Ah, that'd be confusing. All right, fears of rejections. Ace of cups reverse. Coming quickly. No love. That's a fear. Yeah. Dealing with an old relationship. Maybe a door opening or marriage. You get two more. Maybe somebody feels like a fool because they were the goodest boy ever. You know. How this shit starts. How it'll end. Death reverse with the nine of pentacles once again reverse like this shit's not going to end because they don't want to be single but they feel really fucking paranoid and that could be you leo or cross watcher they're kind of like feeling like the cage like they're stuck in something or whatever and people just watch them and it's like it's almost like they feel like they can't be free or something And there you are again, Leo. And it could also be Capricorn, too. It's like... They need to... Someone needs to kind of face their fear. What's the ending theme with the Emperor? The person in control. Like, is this Emperor, like, watching this person? Because, like, he's nowhere in here. But this person's over here. They're just kind of watching him. Being like, what the fuck are you doing? Why are you walking around, like, in a circle, bro? Ew, he might have secrets. Or he knows something. So let's see. What's up with the situation? Alright, so... Person's just like... Hmm. Hmm. 
This feels like a midlife crisis. Like someone's like lost their shit or something. And they can't think clearly. Or something's going on with them that's bothered them so bad. Like they aren't maybe themselves or whatever. And they don't even realize it. So I don't know. This is a weird person. Alright. Yeah, there might be a need to be gentle when it comes to decisiveness or what needs to be cut out. But it's like, it's more like you're more gentle than you are trying to be cutting because it's like, you and this person are a pair. And there's your card again. Yeah, like. Or maybe you're trying to be gentle with it because you guys are a pair. But I don't know, because it doesn't feel like... It just feels sad. Like, really fucking sad, but it's weird. And the situation... Ah, uh, you know, like, they might be breaking their own heart. Like, just hurting themselves. I guess in order to avoid all of this. That's kind of harsh. Like, they're dropping their own swords on their own heart. Because they feel responsible? King of Pentacles? That's weird. Almost like obligation. Hmm. Or they don't want to like feel like they're abandoning. I guess I don't know. Wants and wishes, and true, being honest, but not knowing how to do. It, I feel like at some point they're gonna like just be like, you know what? Fuck it. I'm just gonna do it. You know, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna take some action, cause some shit to happen. And they fail miserably. That's a shame. What else happens? Hmm. But they do try to have a discussion. I just feel like. I feel like they have a hard time talking. Or maybe they just can't communicate what they're trying to say, because, like earlier I said, I don't think they know exactly what it is they're feeling until like afterwards and it feels like this person just has shit in their brain that's going on that they can't focus or whatever yeah like there's a judgment call and they're trying with this obstacle to get somewhere that'll help them out it's like people die and they're going to heaven and shit and then there's a skeleton just crawling out the crypt and it's like creepy and shit but it's like a pretty picture regardless you know might be a judgment call that's like Hmm. It's like they know that if they walk away, the other person won't give a shit. Hmm. It's the fears and rejections. Someone's got to look at this and just be like, you know, it's just a fish in a cup. It's just a fish in a cup. Like. Ew. Are they trying to convince themselves that it wouldn't be so bad to separate? Or are they figuring that out? Like, I don't know. How this shit starts, how it'll end. Someone needs to face their fears about a cage. Let's see. Justice. Oh, okay, well that's cool. They they might do the right thing if they can. Or does someone else do that for them? Here's the Queen of Wands. Is the King out here? Is she out here? No. The Queen of Wands is out here, and there's a little kitty. And there's a little lizard, but the kitty's talking to the lizard, so the lizard can translate it for her, because she doesn't speak lizard, I reckon. Or no, she doesn't speak kitty cat. But the cat's saying shit, right? And she's listening. Let's try one more and see. with everybody being happy. 
So what the fuck? I don't get it. Like, what is... Like... What? Okay. So, like... Is this person, like, going through, like, weird... Like, does this person overthink shit or something? Because it seems like... I don't know. It's like they're almost paranoid for nothing. So it's kind of like, oh, okay. Well, whatever. But everybody ends up having, like, a happy time. It's just like... Everything works out in the end. Why are your readings always this dramatic, Leo? Like, I swear. Every fucking time. It's like a fucking soap opera. It's exciting. But then it's like, eh. How strange. Anyway, Leo, that was your reading. So, if you enjoyed this, you may like, share, subscribe, if that's what you want to do. No pressure, of course. It's up to you. Um... I love your faces, and I hope you're having a good time and a good day, and I will see you later. Bye.